Hello, with this video I want to show you how you can play classic DOS games like Dungeon Keeper, Heroes of Might and Magic, Tomb Raider, Battle Isle, Civilization or Dune on current operating systems like Windows Vista, Windows 7 or Windows 8 or Windows XP and the software that you will need is DOSBox and now we want to download DOSBox and install the software on the PC. At first we uh, go to the Internet Explorer and then to my website gamedoctorpc.de tutorial DOSBox and then we go to the link DOSBox. Here you can see the versions from DOSBox to um, many operating systems like Windows, Mac uh, and so on and we want to have the DOSBox version for Windows so we uh, click on Windows and download the software. We uh, save the file in our download directory And now we install the software. Okay, next. Install. Close. And now uh, you see we have a shortcut from the DOS box on the desktop. But uh, before we could start DOS box, we need to uh, create a folder on the hard disk where we install the DOS games later and where we could start the games. So we go to the Windows Explorer, to the hard drive C and then we um, click right on the click on the right mouse button, new folder and we name the folder DOS. Okay in this folder we will install uh, later the DOS games and this is what we need to um, um, play with DOSBox. We need a DOS game and so we uh, go back to my website and we want to download the DOS game MatTV. The game is freeware and we go to download download The download will start and we save it in the download directory, save. Okay. Now we go to the Windows Explorer, download directory and we copy the data file with right click on the mouse button, copy. Now we go back to our DOS folder and create a new folder, Matt TV. And with right click on the mouse button, we paste the data file. And now we could, now we can extract the file. And to extract this file, you um, need the software WinRAW. If you don't have the software, you can go back to my website and here are the links for WinRAW and also for the software WinZip which you can also use for this. But now we want to start the game and so we go back to the DOS folder and then you must search for the MTV data and move the MTV data to the DOSBox shortcut. And then the game will start and if you want to play the game in full screen you may use the keystroke combination ALT and ENTER. And now let's start the game.
and you see it works.